Right, Tammy, you can't get much better weather than this no, today. No, we're so spoiled, aren't yeah, we? we are no. So <laughs> no. Last week was horrible, a great I think. day for a game. We have nicer weather than almost anybody in the entire day. I'm going to call this. We deserve this, it, I know, yeah. I'll say, this yeah. is like San Diego weather. It's like London yes, yes, right. weather. Yes. yes. You know, uh, complete with all the stars in town. These are the days your jobs are fairly. I don't want to say easy, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Compared to what just happened and what's to come, right? Very much oh, so. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> okay, so nice today, nice tomorrow, mm, on Friday, right. icky Saturday, yeah. icky Sunday, icky Monday. I'm done. <laughs> 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 All right, let's go ahead. Let's take a look at what you can expect. We're going to start off with the weekend because, you know, it's so pleasant today, and we're not really going to deal with any active weather until the weekend. The rain will arrive on Saturday, not first thing in the morning, but it will move in during the morning. It will be the heaviest in the afternoon and especially the evening. Now we could see showers Sunday morning. They should start to clear out with clouds and sun in the afternoon, very similar to the weekend that we just went through. And we are going to be raw and chilly. Highs are only going to be in the 50s. So say goodbye to these gorgeous 70s that we have right now. Uh, we are sandwiched in between two systems, one to the north and a big one coming out of the Gulf Coast to the south. We also are watching a system that is well out to the west. That is part of our weather maker for the weekend. Neither of these two are. There's another one behind this southern system that will be part of our weather maker, and this is how it all plays out. High pressure, I call this the happy weather, the sinking warming air, which is exactly what we have. It's in place right now. System to the north, system to the south, don't bother us. They slide on by. System to the west, that one does bother us. So say goodbye to the system to the south. High pressure in place for tomorrow, another beautiful day with a few high thin clouds. Here comes that system system from the west and it's going to merge with a secondary system that comes up out of the south and this is going to bring us our rain through the weekend. Here we are Saturday morning 7 o'clock give or take clouds but no rain. Rain should move in late morning into the afternoon and we are looking at being heavy at times during Saturday late day and evening and into Sunday morning and then it tapers off. We get a little bit of clearing so we'll have sun and clouds later in the day on Sunday just like the past weekend and on Monday just like this past weekend we're going to wind up with some scattered showers. We're going to do that on Tuesday, and we're going to do that on Wednesday as well. So we're dry the next couple of days. It's not until the weekend you have to grab all that rain gear once again. For tonight, 46 in Philadelphia, 48 down the shore, and we're looking at 40 degrees for all of you in the Lehigh Valley. A pretty pleasant night out there. 72 tomorrow in Philadelphia, 71 down the shore with sunshine, and those high clouds start to move into the Lehigh Valley where it'll be 68 tomorrow. For tomorrow's game, first pitch, it'll be 68 degrees. It'll be sunny. We're going to have winds that are light out of the west and northwest. It'll be a 4 o'clock pregame, and we're going to be looking at the 60s as the game wears on, ending the game right around 61 degrees under clear skies. Then we change. We start to see those clouds build in, and we're only in the 60s on Friday, only in the 50s on Saturday. Hard to even get to 60 on Sunday. Rain both of those days, clearing late Sunday. Kind of quiet Monday, maybe a scattered shower and more rain on Tuesday. And it's kind of chilly all of next week. So let's enjoy this while we can. Let's bottle it up and let's not think beyond tomorrow. Right? All right, Tammy, thank you so much.